Hello, another beer review. So today we have a beer from Brew York. It's a Canada Hop Sessions 005. It's part of a series of beers they do basically where they test out different hop combinations. So I guess they can see what flavours work and use them in future beers they release. Um, it's a Laurel Motueka and Nelson Sorbin New England IPA. They call it a New England IPA. I think four and a half percent you should really be calling it a session IPA. But as I've mentioned in the past, they're the brewers. They know a lot more than I do. Um, so yeah, fifth iteration in this series. I've had all the previous four. They've all been pretty solid little beers. Um, so yeah, in fact, their new core beer, Kearney, which is a replacement for Hairs of Thunder, was use it, used a hop combination from a previous Hop Sessions beer. So they, you know, developed that beer by uh, using this series. So, but they're still putting them out. So I'm interested to see, you know, maybe, you know, Another addition to their core range potentially could come from this series. So, a little bit of dust in the rim, as always. Let's get it into the glass. I'll, oh, sorry, I'll just say what Brew York say about it. I've sort of told them. I know Brew York quite well. Uh, welcome to the Brew York Hop Session. This is an experimental beer series of seriously small batch brews, and it's all about the hops. Using their experience and skills, our brewing team are trying to trying out different hop combinations on a mission to find their and your perfect deeper. So let us know which hop sessions is your favourite. Hashtag BY Hop Sessions. I wonder how much that hashtag's been used. Probably not a lot. But let's get a bit of drips out of the glass. Let's get it poured. Decent hop combination, particularly the Twaker and Nelson. I haven't had too many beers with Laurel in actually. But the ones I had have been fine. So, yeah. Sort of a deep orange. A few fingers of red. So the smell. Smells quite peppery, savoury. Bit of sort of gooseberry, white wine, grape. The Nelson's sort of very um, prominent at the forefront. A bit of lime, some peach, and maybe a bit of passion fruit. Sounds decent, let's go in. Yeah, soft, juicy, quite a bit of peach. Passion fruit, white wine, grape. Maybe a little bit of pear. Hit the lime. There's also a bit of like a bit of floral note in there. There's also kind of a bit of a molly backbone in there. Sort of almost a grainy note on the finish. It's like pepperiness on the there as well. Decent body for the ABV. There's a bit of weight to it. Um, yeah, it's 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 solid, really solid. Another solid addition to this series of beers, and yeah, worth picking up for sure. As in the previous versions, if there's any of them still around, though the hops probably have faded a bit by now. So yeah, thank you for watching. Drop us your thoughts below. Give us a like. Subscribe if you haven't already, and hopefully we'll see you on the next one. Cheers.